Mm-hmm. Nobody, It'll all go away soon. Don't nobody has to know that this happened. YouTube will uh, YouTube will never know about this. Super Desperation Radio! Go! Everybody, what's up? Uh, Super Desperation Radio is live for quite possibly the almost last time on IPW. Yeah, it's getting uh, pretty close. It is. I mean, what? There's only two weeks left in the year. Uh, yeah, just about. Oof. Hmm. It's weird. Okay. I mean, I guess it's hard. It's hard for me to. To not have the 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 slow walk down memory lane when thinking about it, you know, because I think back to all the times that we almost got kicked off this network. Think about all the times the FCC almost shut down. I play winner it all together. Yeah, it's seriously. Jeez. Like how many phone calls did I get from Haunts in the middle of the night, just saying like, "Dude, what are you doing <laughs> to my legacy?" You no, know, the the best was when he called you and um, he was like on that trip in Japan. Oh yeah, that was. <laughs> He had to stop streaming in Japan to tell Hellbox that we're screwing up. He's like, dude, the one thing I asked you was to not invoke my name in the same sentence as IPW and then drop an F-bomb. And that's exactly what you did. So, now I can go yeah. do that to, to Spooky. I can give him heart attacks. Yeah, I don't think Spooky will care as much. Probably not. I think Spooky's, uh, I won't say he's more laid back than Haunts because I don't think that's possible. But, you know, he's, he's definitely his mind is in a different place, definitely. Almost all the time. So, yeah. Uh, next week will for sure be our final show on I Play Winner. Uh, and yes. next year we'll be moving to Team Spooky. So we're not done with the show. We're just, you know, switching channels. Uh, and once again, next week, uh, I will be doing this here thing where I play the listeners, you guys, in a video game on the Fight Cades. And if you beat me, I pay for your subscription to Team Spooky for a month. That's right. He pays for it. With, I pay for it. With money that he has, courtesy of, well, I mean, I guess Wait, I have money? Yeah, no. How are you going to pay for this, man? Like, we don't oh, have man, a budget this for this. A, you, yeah. This, this is basically what I'm telling you. You can't lose. Like, you're not Mike Ross. You have to You have to win. <sighs> why, why can't I be Mike Ross with, like, Twitch backing? There, that way I can just keep losing. It doesn't matter. There's more on the <laughs> line here than just some... Dollar redo Twitch turbos. Like this is man. this is food in my oh. mouth, man. Oh man, this just hit me. What if Mike Ross happens to play me? If you win, does that mean you get a Twitch turbo? Yeah, if I win, do I get Twitch turbo? And if he wins, you get he gets, he gets a, he a gets subscription spooky. to Spooky. Yeah, but he can't mm. even use that shit. <laughs> Damn! Now I'm worried. How am I gonna pay? For He's like, I, I have the wrench. He's like, you got a wrench <laughs> and you got a Spooky skull next to the wrench. Like, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You got all the accolades, yeah. baby. He finally made it. That's that's all it is. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm gonna I'll, I'll go into this again at the end of the show. But uh, I'm gonna play people in Mark of the Wolves, best of three or first of three, one or the other. We'll see. And if you win, you get a you get a month of uh, Team Spooky subscription the, from when we start our show again. So probably in February, I think. Yeah, just around there. Yeah, uh, late January, early February, one or the other. And oh, shit. Yeah, oh shit. Uh, <laughs> we'll, I'll take care of it for you guys, and you know, you get to spam all those sick ass spooky emotes, you know, like the, the skull and the other skull and the other skull. I, I don't know. What else is there? Like the... I honestly have no idea. I, I turn off emotes. <laughs> Smart ah. man. I need to get on that level. Oh, that's the one with ah. ah. Oh, there we. I thought that was just art. I thought that's that's art. Yeah. Yeah. Well, maybe anyway, they share it. You get access to whole new emotes that you didn't have before if you whoop my ass. Yeah. If you whoop his ass, but you that's won't. All I gotta do. Well, I don't know. I might get nervous. You think you might get nervous and you might you might know. drop I the mean, ball? Are you are you are you planning on getting like sweaty palms, mom spaghetti? <laughs> Maybe. Don't think about it. Don't think about it, man. Just just think about the think about the Twitch turbos. 
Oh, the turbos. Yeah, man. Like, just just think about all the uh, Twitch turbo, man. All the the Twitch tang you'll be, you know, rolling in. I mean, like you know, like Ooh, the orange Twitch juice. tang. What? Twitch tang, man. Yeah, Twitch tang. Whoa. You whoa. never heard about this? So Twitch is coming out with its own brand of tang. You know. Is it still a kick in the glass? Yeah, it's still a great kick in the glass, man. Except okay. you know it's purple, which is fine. You know, gotta gotta represent the company. Um. Do astronauts still drink this? I don't think astronauts are allowed to drink anymore, man. <laughs> well, I so heard that astronauts can like they're, they're just they're just buff as shit now because they're squatting three thousand three thousand pounds. That's now, what I'm saying, man. Like, they're all fucking super saiyans, dude. Like <laughs> they're just like up in cha- up in space chilling. In the Who knew freaking... turning off gravity made you stronger rather than <laughs> yeah, having more man. gravity? Hey, you would imagine like it would make you super strong because like you know what happens to your guts when there's no gravity? Like all that stuff you just ate is just like suddenly in your chest and. Nothing but sheer force of will will force it back down into your lower intestine. Mm-hmm. That's going to give you some fucking abs. I don't care who you are. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Speaking of abs, uh, anybody catch TLC last night? No. Um, I thought the group kind of broke up. After the left eye died? Uh, yeah, I mean... Left eye, no, didn't she set a house on fire? She set a house on fire and didn't crash. No, we can't. That's not okay, funny. Yeah, we're done. That's we're done. not <laughs> funny. <laughs> Oh wow! Yeah, so no, I saw uh, someone linked me to some clips of it, and I definitely saw a ladder. Yeah, that's about it. I just saw, saw a ladder. ladder. Barely ever, barely any tables. I think there were some chairs in there somewhere. But it was actually kind of an okay show. I mean, I don't normally talk about pay per views, but I think this was like the one that everybody was dreading was just going to be awful. And I mean, <laughs> they were right for the most part. Uh, but the one match they thought would just be like, you know, a complete circus actually ended up doing what it was supposed to do. And that was before the freak out at the end, uh, before, you know, Roman Reigns suddenly, uh, did and said everything that the entire WWE universe is thinking and wanting to do. Oh, what did he say? Or he just, he's like, I don't care if I get fired. And he just beat the shit out of H. Oh. It was pretty nice. He has a, he had some pretty intense like expressions going on there. Like he finally learned how to emote. I was impressed. I enjoyed it. Hmm. And even before that, like they were hating on the match. Like, dude, there was some point where they were actually chanting, "We want Cena." Yeah, I heard about that. Yeah, that was just that was harsh. I I mean I know it's Boston and that's his hometown technically, but. Ugh. Wait, did Cena not fight last night? He hasn't been in uh, action for about a month or two now. Yeah, he took a break, right? Yeah, he's making movies and stuff. He's trying to be the Rock, but, but you know. But he's John Cena. Yeah, he is the champ. He's also he fought for America. He's also built like a cinder block, so he doesn't really show up on film that well. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, man. Like, I, I, I'm actually okay with him being gone for a little while because when he comes back, it might actually be interesting to see how he deals with the landscape as it is. Are they just going to just throw the belt back on him or are they going to throw him like a super easy, you know, angle that he can squash everybody in again? Or will they make him work for it? Um, I think it's a bad idea that he took a break now, especially that he's getting this meme heat. Like, he I know, be it's there. almost like he's ducking, right? He's almost pulling, yeah. KB, he's pulling them KBRs, man. <laughs> he's like, I don't have to do, I don't have to play you, Roman Reigns. I already won the, the WWE Championship. I'm just here at WrestleMania to hang out with my friends and wear this kimono. Hmm. Speaking of uh, people, you know, wearing outfits weird, the Raiders almost blew it yesterday. No, no, the Raiders did not almost blow it. Yes, they the did. Raiders... I, uh, I need to, you need no. to talk to your boys, man. Oh, look, check it out, check it out. The Raiders blew a couple games, no, several games this season, okay? They legitimately blew those games. Denver... Completely blew this game. Denver did completely blow the game, but it was it was like a really hard blow. And I mean, like the hardest of blows. Like the, you know, if you're gonna talk blow jobs, man, like this one was definitely <laughs> like the most fierce blowing I've ever seen in professional sports history. Where the opposing team, after scoring a touchdown on you. Instead of kicking the extra point, which would put them ahead of you by by four, making it extremely impossible or not unlikely for you to 
you know, come back on them lest you score an actual touchdown. They went for a two point conversion, which wouldn't have made any difference whatsoever. And they blew it. Ball jobs everywhere. Yeah, I'm surprised they allowed that on TV. Yeah, I know. It was just it was just disgusting. Hmm. I haven't seen a ball job that bad since, you know, well I can't talk about it on the show, but <laughs> God damn. Well you I get... can, but I won't. Because I'm a respectable individual, right? I mean, I'm, I'm esports, so that's 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 something that I can't I can't say. Oh, but, okay. So. But yeah, it was it was terrible. Like they they literally gave, and then the best part is like Denver gets the ball back and then gives it up at least four times before times run out. And this is in the fourth quarter, so in the span of like 14 minutes, they had about five chances to get in the field goal range, and they couldn't do it. So <laughs> and, 14 minutes, five blow jobs. Five blowjobs, each more worse than the, than the last one. Like, think of the worst blowjob you ever had, and then five minutes later, there's another bad one, even more worse than that one coming out. Wow. That's that's horrible. Yeah. So bad. So bad. So that's... terrible, man. And they still won! <laughs> they beat Denver in their own house. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. That's good football. Yeah. It really was. It was. It was a sloppy game, but it was fun to watch. Yeah, I enjoyed it. I actually got Harrison to watch it too. He was enjoying it. Harrison watches football. No, he doesn't. That's how. That's how yeah, funny that I game know. was. <laughs> he was asking me the entire time. He's like, "Why did they kick a field goal?" Man, I'm like, "Man, it's Oakland. Like, don't ask me that <laughs> shit." <laughs> what? Why? Why they kick a field goal when they could have hit a home run? I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> but for those who don't know, Harrison, former IPW guy, is now a cap cop. Uh, he is one of the biggest baseball heads out there. and Huge he is, fan. Yeah, he is all about baseball, all about the Giants. So. But he is not about the football life, which no. <laughs> is kind of disappointing. <laughs> it's okay. At least he's got love for his team. Hey, at least oh, he doesn't like there. hockey, right? Jeez. I mean, hockey isn't that bad. No, like, hockey's here. great, but, like, he totally looks like a guy that would like hockey and, like, yeah, probably have, like, that's you know, some secret, you know, hockey He's even got, doesn't he have a Capcom hockey jersey, too? Probably. Man. I should steal he that really should him. get into hockey. He should. Oh, he totally you, has the beard and look for it. You, you should cross-check him and take his hockey gear? Yeah. Yeah. Just, like, right through the glass. <sighs> yeah. Okay, so... So if you haven't noticed, we're we're pretty much you know in the in the OG uh, unit right now. We're the OG unit. Uh, it's me, Gibby, and Walkman. Uh, we've got some stuff to talk about today, but we're gonna try to make this a little more special for everybody uh, who's tuning in. Um, but I did want to talk a little bit about the S and K interview that recently took place with the director of KOF 14. Um, was it Yasa? You, uh, whatever his name's not important right now. Um, everybody saw this, obviously. This was a very uh, hot-button issue a couple days ago. Um, Mad, uh, the professor at Madman's Cafe. Uh, check him out on Twitter, by the way. He was nice enough to translate um, pretty much the entire interview for us. I don't know if he missed anything, but he should. Uh, I'm pretty sure he's got it all down by now. Um, i got to say, it was a very informative, eye-opening experience to read this stuff. One, on one hand, you have... SNK basically becoming the transparent conglomerate they that they never were, you know. They're leaving enti- they're leaving old ideals behind in the past and they're trying to be new and open and friendly to people. And I mean sometimes that's cool. Some of it's working out, but I think when you're a, a company like SNK there's some stuff you don't want to share. Am I am I, am I right in assuming that? Yeah, well, when you're a company, you don't want to share. You don't want to divulge too much information. Right, yeah. You need to keep things private for multiple reasons. Um, one is just, you know, you don't want the competition knowing what you're doing. But that seems to not be the case as much these days in fighting games since, you know, all the open betas and, like, how open, like, how say, Capcom and Namco have been with their games. Exactly. Uh, and, and I guess for the fans, that's great because the fans get to play the games extra early or at least they feel like they're playing it earlier than anybody else. And that's a that's a great feeling, right? Uh, playing an unfinished game a month before you should. It's awesome. Uh, 
But in terms of SNK, I mean, I don't. I guess they're talking about doing a beta too, so that might be something in the pipeline. But what they're doing mainly is just talking all the time. Like somebody asks them a question, and they are gonna chew your ear off with an answer. When you know, it's it's a great it's a great contrast to like you know not getting shit like a year ago. Mm-hmm. Um, but like I said, with that uh, comes some 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 downsides. A double edged sword. Uh, I'm not sure if it was a mistranslation or whatever, but some of those answers probably should have been thought out a little more uh, professionally, I guess you could say. Um, not that they were bad answers. In fact, they were probably extremely uh, f- frank and direct, and I can appreciate that much, but yeah. some of them just did not inspire the most utmost confidence in the product that's being put out here. Um, things such as we don't have a lot of experience making 3D models kind of stood out. I kind of hope that was a mistranslation or perhaps he was, you know, putting it in a context that was lost in once it got put down on text. Because if you just read that for what it is, it looks really fucking bad. Not that everybody didn't know it, obviously. We're looking at this game, KO14, and, you know, there's been issues with how it, with how it looks. Um... And to hear him say that, it just kind of confirms some suspicions that, you know, people have had. I think it's not terrible. Go ahead. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. No. <laughs> I, don't think it's a, I don't think it's a terrible thing. I think it's great. I'm think, like I said, I think it's good that they're sharing stuff. And I think it's good that they're being honest and, you know, maybe in some way admitting that you just aren't there yet not that you can't get there but you just aren't there yet or weren't there yet or just not where you i don't know maybe that's okay maybe that maybe that'll be you know the way people do things and no no this is all wrong what the hell why would you say that shit that is quite possibly the worst answer that you could have ever in in your career possibly and that's pretty much all I really found, as far as faults go with the interview, on at least on the interviewer, interviewee side, um, I'm more disappointed in the interviewer. Uh, some of the questions that they asked were just really softballs, just like standard stuff, stuff we already know, stuff where they just basically fed them the the typical, like, hey, how's your, how's your game doing? It looks good, I think, you know? Like, you know, stuff like real easy stuff. And Hold on a sec. Breaking news. I just got my Techno shirt in the mail. Oh, baby. Really? And it came with Skittles. <laughs> fuck what? yeah. The best candy of all. Why the hell would it come oh, with Skittles? Dude. No, shut the fuck up. I yeah, don't know. I, I was just wondering, <laughs> man. I wouldn't eat those if I was you. <laughs> I'm eating them right now. <laughs> but anyway, like, it's just, they, they, they have a guy, they have a guy here spilling his guts and they don't ask, like, some of the most glaringly obvious, if not controversial questions. He's obviously willing to speak about it. You might as well just fucking make him, you know. What happened to the fucking K of thirteen models? You know, where are the thirteen and twelve models? Do they even exist? From what I saw from the thirteen and twelve models, they were like non like descript, just kind of shaped. No, I understand that they're very much like you know for reference sake, reference sake. So why aren't we referencing them anymore? The I don't know because some proportions were crazy. Whatever. They struck gold. Like there was like, I mean, it, like obviously. How they use body models, right? Like Tekken and all the other games. Uh, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I'm just like maybe we were just spoiled because obviously you know KOF never really looked that great in the first place. All the sprites were very uh, re- recycled throughout the years, so I think people just kind of got used to you know them not looking like crap. And you know nobody bothers to question that. So that's 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 it. that is what it is. I hate saying that, but it's pretty much all you can say about that. Uh, glad you're talking. Glad you're talking about you know being more active. Uh, some of the stuff they were talking about there was pretty cool. Like you know not the party battle stuff and ter- like you know that's not bad. But I'm speaking more about how they're actually looking to improve online you know compatibility and whatnot. Like the fact that they're stepping into the 21st century here. That's great. I can't wait. 
and play my KOF online. I mean, in, the, in like 2002 and 98, you have been great, so. Netcode on now, those games are fine. Yeah. You know, it's always funny, too, because everyone's always like, oh, the netcode on 98 is way better than O2UM. And, you know, that is true. But, like, it always makes me wonder if uh, that's just because 98 is probably, like, a technologically, you like, you don't need as good of a computer. Or, you know, there's not as much, like, uh, under the hood. Do you think maybe programming it's... Programming and all the different effects and whatnot. Like, processes are actually slowing down the... the, the well, the I'm just thinking that... Obviously, the effects and models of 98 aren't probably nearly as much as OTUM and, like, data that has to be processed. So, you know, it might just be easier to That's true. send the data of multiplayer. Like, 98UM still use all the old 98 backgrounds, right? I think so. Yeah, and 2002UM uses those newfangled 3D backgrounds. Yeah, and lots of particle effects and, you know, all kinds of crazy stuff. Well, That's shit. Reason. That was a horrible idea. <laughs> <sighs> but yeah, so that's I'm, I'm you know I'm I'm I have faith in them to make deliver a good game. After playing it at PSX, after hearing them speak so in length about how they got the team from the old games back together to make this game, I'm feeling pretty good about KOF 14 still being a good game. And as far as looks go, you know, they, that's why pencils have erasers, baby. <laughs> I mean, look, I play some shitty looking fucking games. Is that really what you're going to be hung up at this point if it's decent? I know, right? Like, it's kind of like, like, I don't think people realize the crap we were playing before K-13 hit it big. If like, it doesn't look like a Hollywood budget film that had like $200 million dropped into it, why bother playing it? Exactly. Well, you have to remember, in this day and age, it's not a matter of only playing, it's a matter of viewership. That so is the other. Viewership is going to take a hit if the visuals don't. The graphics look bad, but they're no, by no means glaring. It's not I like you're looking at fucking gray characters on a gray background with particle effects flying everywhere. Aside from well, like the very obviously unfinished Andy Bogard model, like everything about this is pretty much just we're, it doesn't look like what we thought it would look like, and people are just you know it's it's a shell shock at you at situation. You know what? Here's my advice to USNK. Keep doing what you're doing. Make it look as good as possible. And if it ends up still looking like garbage, bam! High res texture pack DLC for free on fucking a week or two after. <laughs> Easy, simple. They'll never do that. They're not that smart. That's what I'm saying. I'm putting it out in the ether. Just gonna, have, just gonna like. They do probably their job won't, but you know, take my word, SNK. Do their job for them. Hey, man, you know, wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> <sighs> Speaking of smart. Uh, something smart happened last week on Steam. Oh, yeah. Uh, this game, Guilty Gear Exert, I may not play it, but it came out on Steam. And from everything I'm hearing about it, everything I'm reading about it, apparently it's superior to the PS3 and PS4 version. Um, it's definitely better than the PS3 version. Whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe your computer's not beefy enough. No, I'm not saying... if it, I, I just never played the PS4 version, so I can't compare. Oh, okay. Um, as long as your computer is powerful enough to run it, like, run it, like, full pop, like, it seems to do better than PS4 from what people are telling me. The online is a lot better from what... Like, I've watched people play, like, the same exact people play on PS4 and PC, and it's... You can see without even playing, it's better. <laughs> and they even 4K talk about how gaming... Better. Yeah, 4K game. Yeah, it feels pretty good. <laughs> um, like I've been playing, uh, I was pl I've been playing um, Lewis a lot, and you know, it's a lot better of a connection than I ever got with a SoCal player uh, on PS3. So that's it's nice. not better than my uh, original Xbox Reload. <laughs> well, goddamn! <laughs> where I played against Holy a guy God. who obviously knew what he was doing when I didn't, and I instant killed him because that's how laggy it was. But I just <laughs> threw it out randomly. I, I just want to take this time to say reload here as horrible as reload was on xbox it wasn't as bad as kof 13 and i hate saying that that's really sad because that was a 10 year difference and that, that really sucked yeah kof 13 that was just and kof 12 was leaps and bounds worse than kof 13 yeah oh. so there, there there's at least a progression there <laughs> yeah, yeah there's. so i also know. played a lot of uh street fighter anniversary collection you know third strike online Woo! Oh, you mean to tell me you didn't play the arcade version? You didn't play the CPS3 version? 
Uh, I mean, I did when I went to MGL, but that was different. All right. When I went to MGL, I was just playing fucking random some dudes. That that was that was like also the the story that this happened was like the first time I played Blaze Blue. There was a guy there, and he was like Tager, and he was trying to teach me how to play it a bit. You know, I I had not really played it at all, and it had just come out first incarnation of the game. And then, uh, you know, I'm like, okay, cool. So I went to go play some Third Strike, and I'm just playing Alex. I'm just fucking around. And then he walks up. He doesn't say anything. And he picks Chun. And I proceed to whoop his fucking ass, and then he doesn't say anything. Walks off hella salty, and I'm like, "You were so helpful earlier." <laughs> and then I whoop your ass when you pick Chun. And I'm Alex. You were supposed to return the favor, jackass. Yeah, you're not supposed. To, you you don't say nothing. You just walk away and get all mad. <laughs> He's like, "How did that? How did the, how did this student become the master so quickly?" <laughs> yeah, but uh, if you're a fan of Guilty Gear. I would recommend picking the game up right now. Yes. Because it's $24 on Steam, and you get all the DLC. All for free. It's the same exact version that's on PS3, PS4. It's not Revelator, so don't expect to get Revelator right away. And uh, for $23, this is a steal. Like, you don't pay for any, any of the characters. For the first month only, Yep. you don't pay for any of the characters. After this first month is over... Uh, you have I don't know I think you have to pay for characters colors voice packs and several other things uh, it's all in-game currency and no, oh it's the, all in-game currency yeah there's, no, there's, no, there's literally nothing extra you pay for after buying this game everything is on the disc as it were and is oh, unlockable man. wait 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 I thought you still would have to pay for other DLC characters and stuff if you didn't get it for the initial that first week. I mean, you will if you don't get it this week. Yeah, or this month or whatever. Yeah, if you don't do it then, then yeah, you're ass out of luck. So mm-hmm. get it now. It's only twenty four bucks. Yeah, it's a really good deal for a really good game. Really big deal. <laughs> and speaking of that, we will be giving the game away tonight, uh, thanks <gasps> to a good friend of ours who would like to remain anonymous. He's awesome, though. He is insanely awesome. Uh, he great gave me a guy. shirt. <laughs> yeah, he gave Walkman a Tekken shirt. Um, so we're just going to be doing a random raffle from everyone who's in chat uh, at the end of the show. Or I'll say 10 minutes before the show ends because uh, his. It, we want two things out of this. One, you don't have the game because we don't want to give it to someone who already has a game. And two, you need your computer needs to be able to run it because it'd be a waste to give it to someone who can't run it. So... Uh, I, whoever wins, I'm going to ask you for your Steam information and uh, for your computer specs. And if you lie to me, I will find you. <laughs> That's a, it. I'll just find you. you know. He's a particular sure. set of skills. I have an amazing set of skills. Is what I have. Mm. But we'll uh, we'll do that later, and I'll tell everyone when to do it because apparently this this raffle program I'm using requires you to be active in chat. So if you're if you're not active in chat when I tell you guys to do things and boom, you're not it. You gotta thin out the pool, man. So yeah, which reminds me, tweet, I tweet it out. You gotta get this. as many people as possible in here. No, yeah. I want to win it. I already have the game. <laughs> no, I, I just win it. no, no. I removed you from oh. the damn raffle. You're, you aren't winning shit. Okay, you already got a goddamn techno shirt with free skittles. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> fucking <laughs> jerk. And Look, for no. those who don't know. Mm. Um, I believe it's the Hound. Yes, he has won every single SDR raffle. That's not a good look. No, it's not. <laughs> now, mind you, once again, th- these are completely random. Okay, I use a randomizing bullshit program. I'm gonna get a picture of it to prove that we're not doing any dumb shit on you know behind the scenes. But still, the Hound for some weird reason has won them all. <laughs> it's like got like fifty names. <laughs> I think the Hound's got a shitty computer, so I think we automatically <laughs> disqualify him. Yeah, okay, good. I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll, this guy's I'll running off a Hewlett Packard. <laughs> <laughs> that oh. dude's got his never obsolete fucking Windows 98 PC. <laughs> fucking bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we'll uh, we'll get more into it later. Um, for now, uh, Chris, we have a trailer. We have a trailer for a uh, an upcoming thing, film, happening. You may have heard of it. It is a documentary about uh, the fighting game scene. I've actually not seen this yet. Woo. 
Yeah, Maybe like, you're in it, Chris. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not in it because everybody hates me and I don't belong on anybody's movie. Can you make this full screen, buddy? Wait, everybody uh, hates Chris? You Is want your me to make this full fucking screen? fucking Terry Crews? I wish. I wish I was Terry Crews. I wish I was Keith David you with should, Terry uh, mute us and let the trailer play. That'd be nice. All right, I'm going to do that. Yeah. And I am also going to mute myself. Just depending on the person, it can be very easy to explain. Oh, that's cool, you know. And then other people are like, people do that with video games, you know. People from all over the world play fighting games and they travel to events to play against each other. It was a social place. It was a shared place. It was a place that wasn't really for adults. So if you wanted to talk too much trash, you might get punched in the mouth. Let's go! It's really the big show. It's like the Super Bowl of fighting games. Between all the games, we'll probably have 4,000 players maybe competing in all these games over the weekend. He's just very calculated, and if you throw him outside of that, he kind of loses some of his strength. I can't quit playing until I win Emo. It took me a year. It took me from 2006 to 2007 to beat someone. I, I can't believe where I got in my life just because I, I like fighting games and I can play them decently, I guess. I want it to be huge. I want it so that everybody on the streets knows what a fighting game is. Everything we're doing now is great, and I hope the world catches on to that greatness. But if it doesn't, it's the world's mistake and not ours. You tell them, Seth. It's everybody else's fault. That was nice. Yeah. Yeah. That was nice. So, <laughs> real quick, I just like to say that I totally love how Seth was talking about the all working thing and about if you talk to a lot of trash, you might get punched in the mouth. In. Now, back in the dark history, fucking <laughs> Seth was one of the biggest shit talkers of all time. Yeah. So it makes me wonder, <laughs> did he ever get fucking punched in the damn mouth? I mean, <laughs> would you be surprised? <laughs> I mean, I've I've definitely uh I've spent some time with Seth and he's he's a nice guy. <laughs> he's, he's a great guy. He's, he's a own. great amazing guy. Definitely seems to know how to not get punched in the mouth. Yeah, he probably could talk his way like he could shit talk him and probably like talk him like diplomacy at the same time, I'd imagine. Maybe he was speaking in after like of of, of just being like, you know, a standby, <laughs> like a witness to somebody getting punched in the mouth for talking shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! So yeah, if you wanna um, if you wanna know more about that film project, Rise of the FGC, follow Esteban on Twitter. I believe it's uh, at Esteban. What's his? He has at Hold Back the Block. At Hold Back the Block, which is the production at, company. Yeah, and at the Besteban. The I best put him in chat. I think that dick and unfollowed I'm, me on Twitter. Wow. Yeah, it's fine. I don't know you're, why. You're not why worth did you, why did you, why you put up me... garbage? No, hold on. All you put up on Twitter is garbage about Super Dragon Ball Z or some shit like that, dude. I so it's you. Dragon Ball Super, and it's not garbage. It's actually portraying the characters at their most vulnerable. It's extremely deep. <sighs> it's anime garbage. That's it. Simple stuff. You just you just cold hearted. You don't feel anything. I do feel something for you know a better a better dragon. It's called Dragon Quest. Dragon Guest, more like it. Yeah, Dragon Guest is. That, sick. that looks like it's gonna be the shit. Holy shit, that's amazing! It's like you open the door and there's a dragon there with a bottle of wine. You're just like, damn, this guy knows how to throw down. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, so uh, let's see here. Let me tweet this out. Boom. Make sure I got these things. Good, good, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, cool, cool. All right, so there we have it. We have uh, another. We have a, a documentary that I may or may not be in, but it's okay. I was on ESPN once. 
I bet I'll be in that <laughs> documentary in the same fashion that I always oh, am, man. in the far back corner, standing behind a bunch of people where you can see part of my face. You're not even looking at the screen. You're just like fixing yeah. the wall. For some like reason. every picture of me that isn't like directly taken of me, like I'm just somewhere like really far away. It's just, it's, it's just the best because, like, in all the photos that I like, that where you're not, where you're like accidentally in the photos that I'm in, you're just like facing something. It's like, like, there's nothing there. What's he looking at? <laughs> it's the best. <laughs> I'm like that ghost that ends up in all the photos. <laughs> yeah. Who is this guy? No, it's it's really it, this is really the truth. Like, if you guys have never like looked at these pictures of any of us closely, you will you will like spot a random Walkman, just like his nose or his his hair or something like that. <laughs> or in the, the older pictures, it's his team spooky shirt. Yeah, <laughs> I'm oh, just man. somewhere somewhere there. There's something I wanted to do real quick. I wanted to revive our old, since the three of us are here by ourselves, I want to revive our old uh, tradition of talking shit on people we know and love. Uh, oh, okay. M- Mr. KOF went to ADC. Oh, man. Okay. Hold on. I'm, I'm, of- I'm just, I'm just going to stop this. I'm I'm going to let John be. I'm, I love talking shit, but I love <laughs> you're John. Gonna, you're going to leave John anything. alone? Okay, John, John is good people. He John is great people. I love John. It's just, what the fuck, man? Hey man, I mean, I don't even know the last time he's played. So that's true. I mean, I think he's been practicing with Reynolds and uh, Wild Wallace, and those are two great par- partners to practice with. I just, yeah, man, Wallace went two and two. <laughs> what? Rather than fucking John's one and two. Jesus, <laughs> man! Wow, well, you know what East Coast is saying now? They're saying KOF is dead out here. We're just, we're just done. Well, they're not wrong. Yeah. But I mean, we don't show up to I tournaments. Think so. is dead out there too, so fuck them. I don't care. It's not dead. We got like three guys that play. Yeah, well, we do too. <laughs> fuck yeah, off. And they're better than our three guys, unless you're talking about <laughs> Reynolds. In which case, he's all right, I guess. Yeah, I don't know. He won an Evo, but he's a shithead, anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, poor John, dude. Like that must have. I'm pretty sure he fucking like just got Brandon blitzed out of his mind after that day. Like, there's no way that both of them left that that room sober. Uh, KOF was won by uh, Pedro from Kings of Colorado. Yeah. Really? Yeah, I think... I want to say Chris G got second and Chiardo got third. I I forgot what Chiardo goes by now. Someone someone will know. Oh, Chiardo was it? Wolf something something Wolf, I forgot. Um, He's an old GGPO player. I... You used to play Mark of the Wolves with Probably something good? like Volpine, Wolf, Fang, He's Dog. Okay, yeah. was, he, was he any good at Mark of the Wolves? He was alright? He was alright? Yeah, he right. uh, yeah. yeah. He's one of the better uh, regular players. Okay. I don't know how to put it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if I, ever, if I ever put some time into it, I might be just terrible. Look, man, you can't be as bad as I am, right? No way. I no way. Definitely, like, no, this isn't. A, I, I don't play anymore. I don't play shit. That's why it's gonna be fun next week. Oh, that's right. Are you gonna officially announce that's what that's what the game you're playing is? Oh, I, didn't I say? Oh, yeah, I know. You, I think you were yeah. using like a. Yeah. Uh, you were trying to be like cutty about it for some reason. Oh, no, uh, we just, all knew it was Mark of the Wolves. You're just like he's not saying it. Whatever. <laughs> so yeah, Gibby will be challenging. You can challenge Gibby and Mark of the Wolves next Monday. And win a free subscription to Team Spooky, so you better practice up your uh, your T Zox because that's his weakest character. I'm trying to make this as much in your favor as possible because your ass. Uh oh, everybody seems to have dropped from the call. Well, it looks like it's just my show now. Test, test, hello, All right. All right, back. Oh, servers from West Coast to East Coast. <laughs> yeah. East Coast servers. East Coast. A, all right, now we're on the East Coast. <laughs> now we're on the East Coast. Yo, we are the best KOF scene in the world, baby. Had a um, you know, nice we, little mishap there. It's okay. It's okay. We, we oh, man, we all this. sound like robots right. now. Shit, that's all right. Typical oh, East Coast. Seriously, we sound like uh, switch back to the West Coast, maybe? I think West Coast is fucked. Let's just stick on this for a second. West Coast is fucked. That sounds like a metaphor for life. Yeah. We sound really bad right now. Holy shit. Yeah. I hear everyone fine, but uh, I'll Bra- switch it back. <laughs> All right, you know what? We, we can try some other bullshit server areas. Yeah, try like uh, the Peruvian servers. While we're doing that, London. I'm going to get a couple beers. Hold on a second. Please be in London. 
<laughs> Meet you in London, you <laughs> All right. That sounds okay, actually. Yeah. It's, it's better? It's actually not bad. Sick. We, world All right. we went from the West cool. Coast to the East Coast to London. Yeah. Yeah, now Next we're is in Amsterdam. Dutchman's territory, baby. Yeah. Mm. So, so, what's up? Let's see. How you want to do this one? Mm. We... I mean, we obviously have some free time here, unless you want to talk about Akuma being in Tekken 7. Akuma's in Tekken 7, everybody. Go. So guess what? Here, this is the sick thing about Akuma being in Tekken 7. He was in every single goddamn... He was in every trailer. Uh. They started showing... Yeah, they started showing um, the... Whatever the hell her name is, Mishima. So, guess what? That shit didn't leak. That shit didn't yeah. come out. No one knew until they announced it. How sick is that? That's pretty cool. Now, mind you, what I just said... How sad is it that I said that is sick? That is amazing, right? That's that's kind <laughs> it's of bad. amazing that the information did not illegally, legally. And I kind of no, wonder man. if it has to do with like, man, were they just really good at keeping it under wraps, or just nobody just no, not no. give a shit? No, 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 no. There's this picture of Harada in front of a third strike machine carrying semi-automatic and automatic weapons. Okay? <laughs> There's a You're reason. Like, Anna and Harada like a... shit don't. Fucking AK, not forty-seven. It was like a, I don't know. I don't know shit about guns. The long okay, I just know. I just know you pull the trigger and people die. All right, that's like that's <laughs> what I feel like. So that's I why mean, nothing yeah. leaked. People are deathly afraid of Harada. You know how much tequila this man drinks. You do not want him with tequila, angry with guns around you. Okay, it's just. It's I mean, not, Harada I, looks I, like I would a, agree. a I short not, version I, of my dad. He really does. <laughs> he really does look like a short version of your dad. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, yeah, uh, that's cool though. Uh, yeah, apparently Akuma's part of the Tekken storyline now. This is not a dream match of anything. Apparently, he owns uh he owes uh, uh Mama Mishima a favor. Mama Shima. Yeah, Miss Miss Mishima. Yeah, Mama yeah. Shima, Mishimama, whatever the hell. A favor, <laughs> and the favor is to kill her husband and maybe possibly her son. So, yeah. I wonder Akuma's what she did to, killing, right? to like deserve that. Like, what is she? What she what is what is the favor that she did for him? What if they fought? She beat his ass and didn't kill him. And didn't kill him. And he's like, "Thank you didn't for not kill killing him. me. I will someday come back and kill your firstborn and your mm-hmm. husband because mm-hmm. they're gonna grow up to be huge dicks." Mm-hmm. I mean, he's got to he's got to also kill the grandson. Like, does she know that she has a grandchild? I don't know. Probably I don't not. Assume that she... I think with that because when she said that thing, she's like. When the time comes, if I can't stop my husband, kill him, and if it has to be my son as well. So I'm assuming this was made a long time ago. She's like, Jen, he's a good uh, boy. He's a good, clean boy. Yeah. Leave him alone. He ain't hurting nobody. He, he definitely uh, isn't bringing upon world destruction like fucking his dad and grandfather are. Where they're just like, yeah, fucking carpet bomb everything. Fuck Tokyo, whatever. Well, this kid's just like, oh, I got wings and I'm really like dark and brooding. I'm gonna fly away and shoot lasers sometimes. Yeah, there's this whole what are they called? The Mishima Zaibatsu, right? Yeah. There's some evil ass people, man. That's some hateful people. Some hateful shit right there. Right. That's uh that's what they want to do. Good for them. Uh what do you cool. want to do? Ah, uh, I wanna play a game right now. You wanna play some games? Yeah, I want to play some games. You want to play some games? I kind of do want to play some games. Hmm. It's been a while. It's been a while. Like, it's we do a, a lot of talking about games, but we don't really play. Yeah. It's because we're, we're sad and old. I mean, in my case, I'm a sad old bastard who doesn't play shit anymore. Because my body is <laughs> broken. And it really does hurt to play. So I'm going to... I'm really hurting myself right now by playing a, a fighting game. Oh, man. Well, I mean, I hope you, can, be fun. Hope you can hold together. <sighs> That's fine. All right. So I guess no. we're gonna play uh, some some pre uh, finale of Mark of the Wolves, huh? Oh, all right, cool. Yeah, let's do that. I don't have any other game on this thing, so. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay, yeah. yeah. I'm in the room. Jump in the room. You're in the room. You jump in the room. Jump in line, senor. Yeah. Okay, buddy, do I see okay. you? I see him. <laughs> I got him. Go off of I'll, I'll go off of sneak up on him real quick. Thank you. Dude. Yeah, yeah. That song is a shit. If you don't like that, you hate beat. Nah, dude. Don't you like the Mr. Worldwide version? Fucking nah, dumbass pit bull. DJ Khaled's version too. That one? Are we gonna do that one too? No. That does he have a version? I don't know. That's, that's sure. He's got a version of everything. I think. 
Connecting the server. Did I ever tell? Okay, this is totally not fighting or anything failed. we talk about. Did I tell mm-hmm. to you guys about how Pitbull right is the biggest scam artist in the fucking world? He's like so smart, and I'm really mad. So, like, all of his songs are fucking songs that you hear on commercials. <laughs> and then he's like, "Fuck it, people like this shit. I'm gonna make my own version of this." And then what happens? They like it and buy it, and then. They play that version on the commercials too. He's just reselling the song back to the fucking companies. He's a genius. What? <laughs> he fucking steals that shit and sells it back. <laughs> Holy shit, this guy's a fucking crazy motherfucker. <laughs> I am gonna have to uh I, I'm gonna have to check on that. I I, I have no idea <laughs> if that's true or not. I, I sent you another you sent me another one? Thing. All right, cool. Yeah. Like uh, this motherfucker uh, goes out with, to eat with you, and he says he forgets his fucking wallet, so you buy him lunch, and <laughs> fucking he gets it all. He's like, by the way, I also need another wallet. <laughs> God, what a scummer. Jesus Christ. What a Dude, scummer. that's like, I oh, like disrespect it, but I respect the fucking hustle. On, like, damn, like, on, like he's so yet. smart. Oh, okay, okay. I'm going to put a fucking beat, and then I'm going to mumble over and be like, I'm not even singing. I'm just kind of saying words, and occasionally they're gonna sound somewhat Latin. Oh, hey, what's and then the beat shit. comes in. <sighs> Mr. Worldwide's a fucking scammer. Yeah. <laughs> okay, your button set, Chris. Uh, yeah, I just gotta fix something real quick. <laughs> I gotta. I still gotta set up the damn screen. Oh boy. Oh man, oh, I got Hotaru. boy, Ugh. Hotaru. Hokana. Oh no! Jesus! Oh Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> Not Hokana! No Hokana! Hey, all you do is powerball, man. <laughs> so while while Hell Pockets is doing this, uh, we he mentioned wrestling earlier. TLC. Yeah. Um, Walkman and I went to a wrestling event here in SoCal last Friday, and it was amazing. It was oh, the yeah. oh, like seriously, God. hands down, it was the greatest live sporting event I've been to. I'm hella jealous that you guys <laughs> Man, got to go. I have and get... been to many sporting events. Fucking! No, I, I went to several Laker games during finals, and as loud as it was, it was not as exciting as this shit. This shit was dope, and I'm not even so a wrestling fan. So, so even like, let's put it in this perspective. Like, imagine if you went to a fucking basketball game, and then you got to help shoulder check a motherfucker. You know, like yeah, fucking foul that ass. Nah, I'm serious. Fucking me and Lewis, when we went there, we got to fucking hold on to Gulak's arms while fucking Sammy Callahan came out and kicked his ass. Like, we grabbed him. No, no, not only did you guys grab him, but Sammy Callahan told you something. Yeah. What did he say? I don't even remember. It was so fucking hold caught down. up. Like, hold him down. Oh, yeah. Hold him and down. What did you guys do? Yeah, held we him, held down. him down. Fucking grabbed his arms. Wow, you guys got to be in the show? He got me and threw his torn shirt in my face. <laughs> It was great. You get to be a part of the show. It's like fucking, you know, murder mystery dinner theater, but way fucking better. Because if you don't move out of the way, you might have some motherfucker fucking suicide dive on you. Son of a mm-hmm. bitch. Now, here's a fun thing. See, Ringe and Walkman, they got to be a part of the show, like, by interacting with the wrestlers. All I got was I got wrestler juice all over me. Oh, yeah. That didn't sound good. Yeah, and I was, I was sitting in between Walkman and uh, Ringe. So they didn't get any goddamn wrestling juice on them. I did. <laughs> also, uh, Kim Kaplan was there. <laughs> what? Oh yeah, he really, he really was there. Fucking speedball. Uh, we got to uh, meet several wrestlers, and peoples. So we don't uh, really talk about uh, Exer on. Uh, Steam, but we didn't talk about any of the other games, did we? What other games? Oh, no, no, the other games that are coming out on Steam? No, did not. What no. other games? So we got uh, Blaze Blue, Chrono Phantasm, Extend, Extend which is out uh, now on consoles, but is already outdated. So, god damn it! <laughs> <laughs> and then we got the uh, Undernight Inbirth. Fuck yeah! That's finally in. happening. After how many times did we want that to happen before it even came out on console? I know, right? I'll take it, take it. I'm not even mad. So we also got Guilty Gear. Uh, there was one. There was, I know there's two more, but I can't remember what the one is. Uh, oh yeah, Melty Blood's coming to Steam, and uh, it's really funny because um, Mav 
is because hey, and like, cool, we got an official release, but how much you want to bet the netcode's gonna fucking suck uh, really badly because they're not gonna do anything smart, and my fucking MB caster is like way better, <laughs> and, which I agree, he's fucking really good at that shit. <laughs> and then uh, the best, going back to my Technos fucking oh shirt. Oh my god, this is oh, the shit. This, is, this is what I'm waiting for. I know, it's supposed to come out this month, I haven't even seen it up yet. Fucking the new Kunio game that was on the PS3, River City Super Sports, whatever, All Star Battle, fucking piss ass, fucking Smash Brothers. I don't even know. I don't even know what the English version's called. But it's fucking coming out. It's got multiplayer, it's got all the DLC. Kunio's hitting Steam. More games, please. Fucking Technos is my favorite video game company of all time, or at least it was until it died. No, then so it Million pretty much existed merely as a license holder alone for Kunio and Double Dragon and whatnot. Oh. But then fucking Arc System works bottom up after making a bunch of games for him. So I honestly, with this five different PC releases and the new games coming out, I'm gonna have to say Arc System Works might be my favorite video game company of all time now. Yeah, they kind of got everything going for them right now. Follow them. Yeah, get them to grab. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I'm just glad that they're actually doing something with the IP. Where a lot of it didn't seem like Technos was even interested in doing anything with it, and God knows we needed it. Oh, you know what's really funny too is that a while back, you know that that visual novel that like Sugita made with Arc System Works. I don't know, you know, the guy who does the voice for Ragnar. Yeah. That like VN came out on Steam, but I went to look at it because I'm like, what the fuck is this? Oh yeah, I said I didn't remember this. It's only in Japanese. That fucking kills me. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, yeah, you can buy it on Steam, but it's only in Japanese. I still have not blocked it. Is it just oh, gonna be yeah, you the whole time? Maybe. I don't know. You should be playing other people. I suck at this game. You should be playing Tony. Well, we, we, we can play. Here, we can play uh, 98, if anything. I'm horrible at that. <laughs> you see how bad I am at it. Okay. That's, that'll probably work. There's only so much of this I can take. I thought you had enough of this, like, back in 2012. Oh, I definitely had enough of you. But I think the people, like, I forgot that this right? works. Did, didn't Mike Ross, like, W the next People's Champion or something like that? Or Capcom Cup? Is it, can I really be the People's Champion if I don't even have a belt? Does uh, Mike have a belt? I mean, uh, you I assume like he a, has... You don't got, like, a Dickies belt or something? <laughs> what a dick. Shit! Oh, dear. Free man. Free oh, dear. man! Catch a free man! Man, man, man. why am I losing? He's learning. <laughs> oh no, it hit me with it. Why wow. I think I had like flash kick, man? Where's my blade kick? Where's my blade kick? Give me that. Oh, I should have just fucking did a run super. Press the button! Oh, he did! You weren't supposed to press it then. <laughs> oh, no. I thought I was gonna break it, but I didn't. The... That's not Woo. invul. Woo. Woo! That's bullshit. Woo. I'm not that bad at this game. Oh, yeah. shit. Somebody call knock. I need help. Assistance! <laughs> Emergency! I'm gonna give you a flutter kick. Flutter kick. Give you will start playing like 15 to Yeah! <laughs> what the hell is that shit, dude? <laughs> Fucking shit. This guy with his oh, macros. Dear. Oh no. Reddit is down. Rejoice. That's what you need to do, Rascal Nations. Oh, I don't have meter. Whoops, I screwed up. I'm dead. I'm gonna lose. Oh, I didn't break it! Oh, no. Didn't break it! Ooh. I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. Oh, I'm dead! Oh, baby. I didn't lose. <sighs> I don't lose. You know how much it hurts to play right now? <laughs> Jeez, I bet I can, like, feel... I can hear your bones just... just sliding against each other. 
So for those who don't know, I don't play fighting games anymore because um, I have really bad bonitis, is what we like to call it. <laughs> bonitis. Uh, my yeah, my, my my fingers and my wrist just can't take playing games anymore. Uh, playing on a stick, I should say, and I just hate playing on a fucking pad. Okay. It's gotta be specific games, though, right? Like this can't be like. You know, Honestly, this uh, is one of the worst. Ga uh, this and VSAB. This because of uh, when I use Kevin and just VSAB because holy shit, the inputs in that game, god damn it. Like, you have to be really fast. And I'm not good at fast and no pain. So, yeah. we, we like, I can still do this shit. We have to uh, start a Kickstarter to get Gibby some uh, arthritis pills. Ooh. Oh, why not replace my skeleton with adamantium? Um, I, think we, I think we can right? do that. Yeah. I think we got so the technology wanna, for that. You want to play 98 original or FE? Let's play original. Okay. You know, you know I'm not this. picky. <laughs> I am not picky. So, for those who know me very well, I hate playing 98 on Final Burn Alpha. Oh, it's bad. It's horrible. There's a lot of input drop. There's a lot of... Uh, I can't say a lot, but there's definitely input delay of some sort. And the game doesn't run the way it should. And it pisses me off. Holy Are you? I love here? the game. The game's amazing. I'm probably in here. Yeah. Oh shit! This this thing is massive, massive, man. Okay, I sent you a request. Make sure it's me, not uh, not some other jackass. Yeah, that's one, definitely yeah. you. So All right, let's see if I still know how to do these things. I'm taking a minute to load here. Yeah, it's taking a while. It's taking a while. What time is it? Okay, hey, so we'll you guys be should play ninety. About Twenty minutes. You guys should play 96, you know, in commemoration okay. for uh, BBH beating it. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. For, for those those who don't know, BBH, uh, BBH is an amazing guy. I love him. Um, he, as much as I love him, he plays games like King of Fighters 96. <laughs> God damn it. BBH, I love you, but why? Why 96? Oh, Windjammers. I, don't have I haven't played that in a while. Shit. Damn it. Yeah, so um, you guys should follow BB. Oh, he's in chat right now. You guys should follow BBH's uh, Twitch and follow him on Twitter as well at Lord BBH. He does a lot of great, um, you know, one CCs of arcade games, and it's fun to watch. He does it. Who else? Pasky does it. There are several other people. I've, I was going to compile a list. Yeah, Macaw. Uh, I, sh I should compile a list of all these people because I, I'm happy. That this whole I, I'm, I'm gonna call it revitalization of arcade games. I don't know. It's just Once people are all into score arcade runs. Games. Yeah, these are amazing to do, amazing to watch. You're gonna have to be my ass for free here. I'm still setting up. Just gonna reset. Yeah. I just gonna reset. Oh yeah, where's the gameplay at? It's coming. Fightcade wow. does not have uh, auto capture yet. Yeah, wow. uh, that's the other thing. Last night, BBH one cc uh, 96 with Chin on his back. He's an old man <laughs> lying on his back, beating the shit out of everyone. He beat the shit out of a god. Wait, is he a god? Yeah, he's a god. Really? Wait, I really? play winner for good. I mean, we probably would come back and do something if I play winner deemed it, you know, appropriate. Yeah. But, I mean, we'll, we'll honestly, I'll stream out of a fucking cardboard box. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Look, guys, I live in a cardboard box in the desert, all right? Just, don't worry. I got this. I was hey, just there. You ain't nothing I special. I ate a cardboard box once. Ooh. It was you like... ate my house at one time? Mm -hmm. It was delicious. So, we will definitely... Speaking of houses in Lancaster on... disappearing... <laughs> all right. Wow. <laughs> uh, damn. <laughs> um, woo. I'll never forget. <laughs> Real I'm that yeah, petty. B B B B BBH. Doing, doing, Did we uh, broke that story, didn't we? Better. Yeah, we're not talking about that right now. Um, <laughs> so, your button's good, Chris? Yeah, I'm good. Okay. So, what was I saying? Yeah, go follow BBH on Twitch and Twitter. Uh, great guy. I've known... I think I've known BBH for 15 years now. Something like that. Long ass time. Uh, he's good at video games. And he's... Fun to watch. Let's see if I still remember how to play this game. <laughs> Damn, Hanzo's so witty. What a fucking smart guy. <laughs> <What the laughs> I just saw that? what he said. God damn it. I don't mean it that in a sarcastic way either. I'm just saying. Yeah, I know. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Esports. Fuck. So oh, what? No. This is why I hate this goddamn game. 
Thank you, Kyo, you get him stupid get him schoolboy pile of shit. Damn, it's like we're not leaving, we're actually being forced out. Get the riffraff out of here. FGC isn't PC enough. Uh, get him. Uh, it's all about that there, um, uh... Take these knees, baby! What's him calls it? It's Hearthstone. Yeah! That's what we're all about. Yu-Gi-Oh! Oh. Online. Yu-Gi-Oh! <laughs> Where's my EX? Oh, you want EX moves? Yeah, I forgot. EX moves are kind of good, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, speaking of streaming, with all this fucking <laughs> shitty overtime I'm getting at work, I'm gonna buy that card. So you'll see me perhaps stream more if I decide to show you the secret streams. I'll probably just fucking stay hidden. It's all about <sighs> that paper! Yeah, uh, I mean, it's not all about the paper for me. I got plenty of paper. I need, to, I need some other things in life. Uh, <laughs> why is it all about the paper? I thought our motto was it's all about the nookie. I mean, uh, it's also, sorry, Paul, uh, Paul's not here. Paul's not here. It's not about the Jay Z once said, "Spin the cheese." So I'm all about that. I gotta get a wheel. You okay there, Chris? What are you trying to do? I hear buttons. Big pimping. Spin the cheese. Ah, spin oh, that. Oh, just get him, get him, get him, jackass! I was hoping I, I was hoping I could beat you like I did uh, Roger Dodger that one time. Is that how you beat Eric? Yeah, I just beat him with crouch. See, that was it. That was That's hilarious. lovely. I want to see that in real time. Uh, Chris, ADP. Never do CDP. ADP is stupid good. CDP Never. sucks because if you don't hit with the first hit, then you're not gonna get knocked down. You're gonna get killed. See, see, he's learning. He's learning. <laughs> That's how I play Kai. <laughs> yeah, I, I watched. There's no instant thrust. In this game. Vapor thrust. I don't know. Just double thrust. quarter circle forward punch at footsie range. Oh, you see that? Oh, it, went right. low, Invol guys. it went over low. You see that? Oh, wait, you're playing <laughs> Oreo. The good Rio. The yeah, the other Rio sucks. Oh, no. I thought it hit. I thought it hit. He doesn't suck. He's just. He sucks. Oreo's just dead. Oh, wow. Really? Hit him with the rice. Official rice shown oh, on screen. Oh, come on. That was mine. That picture's been there the entire time. Did you finally get to see some rice? Yeah, I can still do it. Because <laughs> you probably won't be seeing that shit in King of Fighters 14 if hops and jumps are the way they are. Seriously, uh, man. Like, you can't <laughs> even Raging Goose. Uh, Raging Goose Gorilla Mall is quite possibly the greatest goddamn burger I've had oh here in Sonic. And I've been to. <laughs> not joking, I've been to like hundreds of burger joints here in SoCal that have been considered amazing, great, but holy shit, Gorilla Mall is amazing. Damn! And to stay, uh, fighting game related, Gibby made sure to get the, uh, Napalm Death, you know? Yeah, I got Napalm That's not fighting game related. <laughs> yeah, it is! Don't try to take is, that from man. me. Gosh. We're, we're, we're appropriating metal culture <laughs> into Gilly. <laughs> okay? <laughs> oh dear, what am I doing? Why is it? Why am I getting DPs? Getting fucked! There's a DP. There's another DP. So, uh, at Grill Them All, in case you were wondering, I got a burger known as the D Snyder. It was a bacon cheeseburger with sriracha, peanut butter, and jelly. It was fucking amazing. I I probably can't Get have burgers here. with more, more so, I can't have peanut butter and jelly probably without a burger patty or some bacon or something savory in there. It was way too genius. Our friend uh, got. I don't even know how to describe it. <laughs> it, it was. It was called. Wasn't it called the Christmas Beast? Yeah. It essentially. Oh. It tasted like eating a holiday meal, but you just piled everything on top of each other. Like you're like, oh, I'm gonna make a sandwich, but the buns are gonna be like, you know, pumpkin pie with ham and turkey and cheese and everything Ooh. with like an egg. It was ridiculous. When you and when you ate it, it was like seven different flavors in your mouth at the same time. It was I don't even know what the heck was going on, but it was great. Yeah. And then uh Ringe had a uh, Samoa Joe. Ah yes, Samoa Joe representing named the boy. After, I think that's the only thing that wasn't named after metal, right? Or is Samoa Joe some kind of metal thing. No oh, bugs. Uh I don't know. Could be. I mean Maybe I'm Samoa assuming Joe's that uh old cousin Joey likes uh fucking you know, metal, knowing knowing his his cousin Luca. You know, it's probably. Oh dear. Uh, the buns were not Hawaiian rolls. 
Oh, how did That's I not catch him? Doghouse. Doghouse Dog House does Hawaiian rolls for everything. Doghouse is also very good, but grill them all, I had to say, it takes the cake. It's not grilled them all, it's grill them. I said grill them all. No, he said grill them all. Gorilla mall? Stupid. Yeah, gorilla mall. At the gorilla mall. I like I like gr gorilla mall better. That's the best. Oh, man, man. Get him out! Get him oh, I out! I died. I died. Huh. Okay. And for those who uh, aren't uh, big on beef, they offer vegetarian and turkey options. Oh, that's still hit. Get out of here. Hmm. Get out of here. Oh, no. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, yeah! Grill them all was super yeah. cool. Like, everything oh, was dead. like metal and like everything on the walls. And then when we came in, there were two TVs. One of them was showing old WCW, and the other one showed uh, Back to the Future Three, which led into a Christmas story. It's pretty amazing. Also, I don't know how old Stan Hansen was, but that was definitely like Number the late eighties, and he already looked old. So yeah. <laughs> If you ever, in, if you ever come to SoCal, uh, go to Gorilla Mall. It's good. Gorilla Mall. Good. Yeah, Gorilla Mall. Good old Gorilla Mall. <laughs> uh, I need more beer for this. <laughs> you don't have enough beer for this. Oh buddy. my god, dude. Are we really <laughs> at seven seven thirty seven right now? Like, time flew, and so I don't know what happened. What happened? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm still mad about that super. Oh yeah, I understand it's not like beef then. But at least you got some... I'm assuming it tasted better than regular beef. But, uh... Oh man, look at him go! Oh, I need that. Wow, are you playing old Joe? Yeah, man! Wow! Bad... Bad choice, brother. <laughs> bad, bad life choices. Oh no, Abraham. Damn. Wow. Oh, I lost. So I missed my super. Kale choices. Abraham, man. Jesus. Oh, oh man. Jesus. That's what you guys are talking about. The Marvel yeah. money. Guys. Yeah. Did you see that shit? That motherfucker got his shit pushed in so hard. And he's like the whole it time. He's like bad. the whole time. He's just looking at himself like, man, like what's wrong with me? Why do I keep doing this to myself? And, and he didn't call for like the double or nothing too. Like, <laughs> in the background, he's just like, motherfucker, why do you keep showing up to my tournaments and losing all this money? <laughs> and then afterwards, he after I he hope lost, he, he like, fund him. well, no, well afterwards, like he just started talking oh, to him like a disappointed dad, just gave him, like the hands on the hip, loud talking. Yeah, it was hilarious. I love it. Uh, get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, baby. Let's go do it. 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 Do it. Do it. Oh, wow. I like that. Yeah, shit. Sure. No. Get away from me, Shermy. Yeah. Oh, I was hoping that he, that would catch you. Damn it. Oh. Oh, double? Double? No. I'm no. Sorry. How the hell did that trade, though? That's ah. not a, that's not a move that's supposed to trade like that. Who would I rather have in taken seven, Mimi or Christy? Uh, fucking not Ganryu. <laughs> I'd rather have uh, a real sumo character. That that's what actually should be the other part. Uh, yeah. the, the the secret last character in the game is just like, in case Akuma goes crazy, I need you, fucking. Uh, Fucking Taka Arashi to stop Akuma. <laughs> He's like, all yeah. right. <laughs> I'll do what a real return. top tier looks like. You want to see fucking 50 50 throw mix up that does fucking half your life, regardless? <laughs> you have one chance to not fuck up, buddy. <laughs> oh, God. Taka Arashi's the best. Oh, man. He needs to be in a new game. Yeah, a new game called Virtual Fighter 6. We Did all know that's make, not gonna happen. Uh, 
They should make a crossover fighter that just has all the sumo wrestlers in like one game, which is like six from fighting games, I think. But you know, I'm cool with that cast. Ganry would be the worst, and then probably Honda, and then it'd be a toss up between you know Hinako and Takaarashi at the top. Oh, what? Look at all that work I did. You got me in one throw. It evened it up. I hate Jeremy. I'm gonna warm up them ribs. <laughs> God damn it! Get off me! Ah, oh, messed that up. Yes! So what if they make Virtual Fighter 6 and they use their newly uh, acquisition oh, property of Atlas and decided to put make a Persona 4 Virtual Fighter 6? Because <laughs> Persona 4 will never die. Wow. I think, <laughs> I, think Arx, I think Arx's next big uh, crossover game should be the Dragon Ball game. That's just me though. Cause they're... I'm just waiting for them no, to fucking no. have summonable like SMT like Sonic or some bullshit. Look, check like, out yeah, Demon Conversation. Arxis should get together with Square Enix, okay? And they should really consider making Dragon Guest, alright? I agree. That game needs to be made. I don't know how it's gonna work, but... I mean, I think everybody's gonna be happier for it. Shit, that was supposed to be DP. Honestly, Virtual Fighter and Dead or Alive are closer in, you know, control you style. Really? Still. DOA didn't have, uh, doesn't have a sumo character. Why didn't they put in Taka? Where was Taka? He doesn't fit the uh, aesthetic. <laughs> Shut <He's>, up! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no, he does fit the aesthetic. What are you talking about? Nah, man, he doesn't fit the aesthetic. He was, he doesn't want to make the other girls look bad with his exactly his, right. His, 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 his moves. <laughs> his his bust is superior to all of them. They even made fucking Bass turn into a little baby bitch boy. Fucking, he like, got cut in half. All his gains fucking disappeared. <laughs> he fucking did too much DDP yoga and he got no more muscle. I should have voice punished that. Oh! Jesus fucking oh! Christ. Oh! Oh! What is going on? I just see Vulcan punches and fucking... <laughs> John Redskin. <laughs> Redskin just like... <laughs> What is it's this? called like the fastest respect, game of right? rock paper scissors in the world, and everybody's throwing rock. Yeah, <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> rock, 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 rock. Woo! Oh dear. Uh, yeah, but I really want Dragon Guest to happen, you know? Yeah. Uh, it's basically a dating sim where you're a knight that is uh, inviting a dragon over for dinner. <laughs> <laughs> it's and true. Your name is Erdrick. Your name is Erdrick von Lotto. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Jesus fucking Christ! I'm gonna right <laughs> Time is it? Okay, we'll play two more and then we're gonna get onto the raffle. Yeah. So the reason I want ten minutes for the raffle is to uh, be certain that the person can actually play the game and shit. You know. I want to be safe. I don't want, you know, someone getting the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow, that was projectile. <laughs> wow, we actually, yeah, thinking about it, the King of Fighters on stream going back to our old roots. Yeah, man. What started it all? Well, that's not good. Close enough. Oh, dude, that was, that was my CD. No, that was short hop. Oh, that's actually good in this game. Wow, did you notice how I was still back turned? Yeah. Like, look in the replay. I'm still back turned. After I golden heal past your, uh. Shit. I don't know far, but yeah. Damn! Back turned forever. Because you went oh, wow. I got caught. animation recovery in the block. That's awesome. I'm so good at this game. Wow, Jesus Christ. Wow, that beat Stan C? Holy shit. I can't wait for Armored Ralph to wow. be in King of Fighters 14. He's gonna be on a team with uh, Duke. <laughs> and, uh, I don't know. Someone else who blows up your guard immediately. Duke destroys guard. Like, my first time playing that game. So I played someone in ST, beat the living crap out of him. 
He's like, oh, you think you know what to do? Have you ever played King of Fighters? I'm like, yeah, I, I play King of Fighters. He's like, okay, and then he plays me in freaking that shit. I'm like, oh, this is not King of Fighters. What is this garbage? <laughs> He's like, I didn't say it was. I just asked if you played King of Fighters. No, no, he said it was a true, it was a true KOF. Game. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, it was about. numbered. I bet. I bet it was 06. Yeah, and I was explaining <laughs> to him. Yeah, and like, so for those who don't know, I I helped beta test the the King of Fighters Maximum Impact games, and I explained this to him. He's like, no, you didn't. I'm like, yeah, I did. He's like, well. And then he drops my name. He's like, oh, well, you know, the only person that I know in the SNK scene that would do this is a guy named Gibby. Like, what have you been calling me this entire goddamn time? He's like, I didn't even bother because you're such a scrub. Yeah. No, he seriously called me a scrub. I was like, what? <laughs> no, I mean, mind you, he beat the living shit out of me in uh, that game. I, did, I didn't know that when your guard is broken, it stays broken for the most part. You just can Yeah, until the bar refills. Yeah, I didn't know that, and I'm like, why can't I block? He's like, dude, because blocking is cheap. I'm like, what? I mean, there was a parry mechanic, but you probably didn't know that. Before. No, I, I didn't know that shit. Oh no, line. I was gonna slide into that. And the fact that I even did. I can't wait Go for back. Vanessa to oh, not in the game. No my and no Blue Mary, and uh, they're gonna actually take back on the on hill. I can't wait. Just remove all of the everyone's favorite female characters. I want to see everybody really fucking mad. <laughs> that shit would bring me the greatest of fucking pleasure. Just people's misfortune. Oh, I saw that coming. I'm like, hey, he's gonna rock guys me if I yeah. jump, and I did it. Like, whatever. Oh, it's always jumping. <laughs> Couldn't um, help myself. Yeah, I was so upset when I played that guy. Cause I'm like, wait, you mean to tell me blocking is cheap? Why? Oh, because if you block, then there's no way that I can hit you. You know what that sounds like? That sounds like that sounds like somebody we know that I won't say. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't it though? Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I want to see how Onhel plays in this one because if she's gonna be the same, like, like ninety percent of people won't play it. Just like, just kind of like Ash. It's like, yeah, John played Ash, but nobody else is gonna like fucking try. No. Want to do these wake oh, of course he did it. Of course yeah. he did it. What the hell? What Actually, if Anhel isn't even top tier or high tier, I'm sure no one will still play either. Anhel? Yeah. What? Where's my crouch be, you son of a bitch? There'll be like one Japanese yeah. player. Oh man, I was supposed to be close to NC. Running like a boss, baby. Yeah. No. Hurt on hell. No. No. What the um, shit was that? I'll have you know, oh dear, on the that the <laughs> <I ran into. laughs> romanization of her Japanese name is Anheru. Anheru. So, fuck you. It's not Joel. It's not a GIF either. It's a GIF. <laughs> it's a GIF. <laughs> I post the. <leave. laughs> <laughs> oh. Hey, what a You got the GIF, man. Wow, I can. Hey, you know what it is. You couldn't guard cancel that? No, I was bashing the shit out of you. Mm. <laughs> I wish I was a Cholo. I mean, I can. I know I can. You kind of are. <laughs> I'm so bad. <laughs> so hey! I grew up in a <laughs> suburb. <laughs> what? <laughs> of course, it was in a poor neighborhood in the Central Valley where everybody was. Over 47% of the city was Mexican. That doesn't mean anything. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Son of a bitch! Yeah, the old roll super. Yeah, just just slapping the crap. Hey, Lara taught me that. <laughs> uh, that's, that's not a joke. It's so sad. I used to hate playing people on camera. Yeah. Wow. Really? <laughs> I didn't think that would work. Oh, what? I didn't think he had a third one. What? Does he not have the command grab in this? Yeah, in that shit. elbow, man. Okay. Whatever. What do I have last? You had a uh, hider. Go like to hell. Gameless. Yeah. No games. Never coming back. I hope. Oh! Watch as I eat my words if fucking 14 comes out. <laughs> it's okay. 
With quick max, he won't be able to do his stupid DP combo bullshit. He'll only be able to do one DP. <laughs> Oh, that was mine! Whoa, what was that? That wasn't... Uh, roll behind the crack shoot. Cool. I roll uh, behind the crack. Good shit, good shit. That was good, good, good match, um, man. I'm, I'm shaking your yeah, hand. Yeah, it's from good that we there. stopped there. My goddamn, my hand is hurting. Dude, yeah, man, take it easy. Holy shit. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we're going to start the raffle right now. If you guys want in, you need to type in something in chat. I'm removing uh, members of SDR. I'm removing Hanzo Gonzo because, you know, he's Hanzo Gonzo. Wait, he actually signed up? Ah. What a No, no, scummer. that's just all you have to do is say something and you're in, and you're in it. What a scummer. Say Come something on. in chat. Yeah, just say something in chat. Something in chat. Wow, you guys are so clever, can you, Ann? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, whoops, that was the wrong, wrong one. Whatever. We're just that's banning fine. everybody who says something in the chat. Yeah, you're banned. As All as right. we burn down, I play winner. You're banned, you're <laughs> yeah. banned, you're banned. <laughs> we'll see you guys next year. No, so like somebody asked uh, earlier, like, will we be gone from IPW for good? I don't think we will be. I think um, no. we're going to still be producing content. It won't be as regularly, obviously, but, I mean, the door is always open. We still work with those guys. We're still good friends and everything, so most likely we'll be – Pretty closely with involved. Guys, with we fucking run this Look, shit. I, I play mean, nobody spooky. here. Yeah. I play Winter <laughs> and Spooky are basically under the same umbrella. Yeah. Uh, things that we can't do on Spooky, we'll end up doing on I Play Winter. Like we plan to do more online tournaments. Right. We're definitely doing another SDR Open next year. Probably yeah. a couple so, of them, especially with Guilty Gear uh, on Steam now. <laughs> and things that uh, we can't do on either of these channels, well, you know, it'll probably be on UStream in a back alley. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, we're gonna do the uh, secret U stream phone stream like from last uh, Instagram. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. Be like, yo, check it out. We play in CeeLo out in the streets. It's the real esport, baby. <laughs> oh shit, he pulled out his Glock. Get the fuck down. <laughs> I think these boys run with the triple set nine. Okay. All right. So Chris, the number hasn't gone up. Okay, sign. so check it out. Fucking pull uh, out your heater. Anthony, quiet. God damn it. Um, I'm gonna run the. I'm gonna run it. Click. Uh, do this thing, and the name is. Come on. <laughs> this works, right? This, this, uh, I mean, possibly. I don't know. I didn't, I don't even know what it is. That's just taking forever. As ghetto as Ustream is, I can still listen to my club anime music that plays on the first Sunday. Of the first no, it's not the Hound. Don't worry. If it's the Hound, I'm Picture of it. So God damn it, boy. <laughs> it's raging goose, but wow. It won't... Okay, there you go. There's the picture thing. We got a picture just so people know that it's not fucking bullshit. Yeah. So, uh, raging goose. Uh, where are you? Where's your computer stats? Where? Which your processor? Which video card? Which your RAM? Who the hell's raging goose? He's raging goose. Like is he, 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 he was in chat earlier. He, is, is he in he chat? Asked me something about thing. If, he, if he's not here, yeah. and, oh no, he's there. I see him. He's in the, he's in the oh, chat. Okay, so. okay, yeah. Congratulations, man! You are now proud owner of a guilty gear. No, Steve, what? Not yet. I gotta see them computer specs first, baby. <laughs> yeah. Um. So raging goose got it already. Oh, someone already gave it to you. Okay, so let's let's uh, oh, do this again. Oh shit! Well, let's start up the drum roll again. <laughs> All right. Oh, oh, this time it says I'm in this. Fuck that shit. Wait, did he? Wait, hold on a sec. Did he already? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think he's trying to say someone gifted it to him already. Yeah, he yeah, said he already got it. Do you even uh, have the the copy? What All if, right. Like, everybody oh. in our chat actually has it. <laughs> next next winner, Pat the flip. No, Pat, you've already got it. Uh, next winner, uh, Leo Two uh, Sessi. All right. Oh, that guy. Fucking... That guy definitely doesn't have it. Streams are blow up. I don't think Leo even has a computer. Oh, Leo doesn't even have a computer. I don't know. Because I know Pat has the game. I saw him beat the shit out of you, Chris. Fuck. 
<laughs> he saw and that, that whole pad recorded every second of it. <laughs> that was out of practice. That was patience. He's good. <laughs> Kenyon, I understand that you can run it, but please win the <laughs> raffle first. <laughs> if, okay, if I roll this shit again, okay, uh, where is Leo? I, I saw him say something in chat earlier. If Leo's God not damn here, it, Leo. If Leo's not here within a minute, it's got a timer on here. It's at 52 seconds. If he's not here by the time it says two minutes, I'm going to roll again. And then uh, if Ken Uran yeah. wins, God damn it. He, he earned I it. Mean, <laughs> yeah, 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 Pat, Pat, Pat recorded it, maybe. Yeah. Damn it. That's not so bad. I thought it was your, I <laughs> I don't was know, your right? friends, Pat. All right, there's Leo. Oh, you got it? All right. Hold on. Not yet, not yet. I need to make sure Leo can actually run the game. Yeah, where's your fucking computer? <laughs> oh damn, the fuck you help pocket this guy. I hope he, I hope his computer can run it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna run his ass. Some guy kiss day. <laughs> oh man. Like that's that's the most important thing because he's here. So, we know, we, we see yeah, him. he's here. I know. I, I'm asking uh, the he, question. He's yeah. like he's all yelling at us like we don't see him. I'm just going to time them out real quick. Oh, and I like that. This thing tells you when the person responds to you. That's sick. Yeah. This is a nice little thing. Hey, hey. Let me Who's see a picture. Someone? Give, me that, give me that DX Diag bullshit or whatever. I don't even yeah, remember. Who is this person? So, man, there's so many games I want to buy from Steam now. I know, right? Like, Arxis, please. I can only take so much. Although I am definitely... Uh, River City Sports Challenge should be out this month, so that's probably the right. other game I'm going to buy. Uh, and uh, I'm Leo, immediately you... going to make myself in the game. Leo, do you happen to have a Twitter oh, account? Yeah. It'll be easier with a Twitter account. I hate sending messages on here because it's a shitty ass. <sighs> yeah, Twitch doesn't inform you when you have a message. You have to actually go looking for it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Daryl. Okay, let's take a look. What? This isn't your computer. This is definitely my computer specs. <laughs> <laughs> Except I don't run Windows 8.1, so it has to be your computer. All right. <laughs> Leo not responding to this this question about the Twitters. Leo, come on, man. Leo, please. Come on, man. So, while uh, we're waiting on Leo... Oh, man, this is terrible. It's killing the air. There, yeah, like, what? Yeah, to what? Come on, man. Give Ma me your Twitter. Yeah. Ding. Ding. Yeah. Okay. I, f I fucked it up. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. So, I just I just got a large pizza with my pops, and we split it, and it was pretty good. I don't even like pizza that much, so... What? Yeah, you know I don't. I prefer burgers and beer. Pizza and beer is all well, right, too, but... I agree with you that burgers are superior to pizza. Yeah. But that doesn't mean pizza by any means is bad. I don't think it's bad. I just think, you know, why have a pizza when I could have a burger? And so it just never comes pizza. up, basically, because there's always Pizza a is more cost-effective. <sighs> Maybe if you're in a group. And I don't like leftover pizza, either. Mm. Just not a pizza. Okay, guy. so here's a question for you. Pineapple on pizza, yes or no? Pineapple on pizza. It depends on the pizza. Well, yeah, but does that mean that if you if I handed you a cheese pizza with pineapple, would you turn your nose up? If it's just cheese and pineapple, hell yeah. You would you would eat it or you would not? No, I said I would not eat it. Oh, God damn it. Trash. Wow. All right. Some bacon on it at least. Where, where, your hat, consider it thrown outside of my car. <laughs> fuck it. I'm throwing it out the fucking window. You're done. <laughs> I, I I mean I I gotta stick to my convictions here, man. Like it's, if there's no bacon or ham on it, then what's the point? Fuck, man. I mean I guess that's okay, but I am down with pineapple in any any regard. I mean, that's cool. That you do you, baby. I'm gonna gotta do me, boo boo. <laughs> <laughs> I can't tell if you've had too many or too few beers at this point. <laughs> <laughs> I can't feel my lips, uh, man. I'm fucking like, like it's like I've been like sipping on Novocaine. <laughs> damn. Yeah. Shit's cold, real cold. Anyway, if any of you don't like pineapple on pizza, 
see me in Windjammers and I'll kick your ass or something. Fuck you guys. <laughs> I might be Peppertoni and the Crispy Pep is what I'm all about, but pineapple is a fine topping too. I mean, pineapple is just good in general. This I just don't think it goes well without bacon. Yeah, you know, I hate that bullshit. Hey, pineapple's really good, but I can't oh, have you're it. You're such kind of fucking foods. weak ass apologist. <laughs> I'm, well, no, you're you're the one who's trying to make up this whole story. That's what you try to do. You try to make yourself yes, like some kind of like no. mealy mouth apologist. I'm just saying, it's an okay, it's an okay fruit. But if you're gonna eat it with cheese and bread, you need shit, the bacon. I probably still eat it. <laughs> See, you have a problem. I honestly get. I honestly make sure I don't get any Canadian bacon on my pineapple pizza, so I can get more pineapples. I mean, that's fine if you want to be, you know, disgusting. You know what's awesome about this? Product? Look at this. If you put fruit on your pizza, you're offending my heritage. What do you think tomato is, you fucking dumb fuck? <laughs> wow. It's not a fruit, fool. Wow. <laughs> uh, before we go... What's up? Did, did, sure. did we figure this out already? Is it good? No, I, I sent him the information. Okay, cool. I, I just okay. want a response from him. Um, before we go, I just wanted to say uh, we had the opportunity to talk to Kenny Omega. And Kenny Omega definitely said he would beat the living shit out of Xavier Woods in any game. Any I believe game. it, man. Xavier Woods fucking Any ass. game. Yeah. And I would like to see this happen. I'd like to see myself against him in Windjammers because he talks big shit. Didn't Xavier Woods, him. like, duck an actual FGC, like, player? I, I, I don't have know. no I, idea. I, I, I didn't even know, know that he... Uh... He was, like, talking about how nice his fucking, like, his, uh, his forte was, like, to somebody. And then... They never actually played because he was like, "Oh, I'm I'm busy like being a WWE star for not another four years." <laughs> yeah, I know the only person I know that ducked someone in the FGC, like celebrity wise, was Fifty Cent. He oh, ducked yeah. uh, Justin Wong Duck way Justin back when Street Fighter Four came out. Mm-hmm. That was hilarious. So you will use Going a bitch back to fifty. On pizza, real quick. Yeah, I have to agree with Marvel's win. Uh, people don't understand gastronomy, so get fucked. Gastonomy? What? Yeah. None like no pineapple on pizza like Gaston. It's built like Gastonomy. <laughs> no one claims to be good, but really shitty at fucking poverty games like Gaston. <laughs> and everyone else. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bell, I can kick your ass in Windjammer. <laughs> Get fucking laid out, because he ain't shit. <laughs> oh, I'm so legit in that so- game. <laughs> Double or nothing. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, today good show, good show. Um, yeah, pretty good. Mm-hmm. I I would say uh, if this was the last show of the year, it would be right on par with the last last show of the year that we had when we were still Coughcast. So I think it's a mm-hmm. good job. Also, don't forget next week, uh, play me, Mark of the Wolves, beat me, get a month subscription to the Spookies. You saw how bad I was today. Yeah, he's terrible, man. Uh, you guys got this. this it's bad. not a joke. Yeah, it's not a joke when I say I'm not good at fighting games anymore. I just really can't be good at them. I can't wait for the next episode. Fucking last week on I Play Winner, less inhibitions, more pejoratives. We're going nuts, people. <laughs> <laughs> I might. We might have to bring back the uh, incident counter again. Let's just say that getting drunk isn't the only slurred speech going around that day. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh, boy. Apparently, we, uh, Hanzo Gonzo just reported us for uh, some stuff. Oh shit! Yeah. I'm gonna get sued. Fuck. We're talking about Damn. Disney on Twitch TV. Damn you, Disney! Stop <laughs> paddling. Also, uh, the Hound didn't win the code. Love you, Hound. I mean, that's a great way to close out 2016, if you ask me. You didn't win. Oh, next week we're closing out 2016. We might give out more shit next week. Oh, that's true. We yeah. might give out more stuff next week, and so uh, you know, I might give around. all of you a lot of shit next week too. I you got know. a copy of King of Fighters 2K2 UM that I'm not gonna ever play. All I'm saying, Gibby, is don't hand Maybe out I'll any. Maybe I'll give it to someone. Like you got, you got to play solid, man. Don't hand out any blowjobs. I can't, I can't be Mike Ross. I can't. Mike, I love you, but I'm sorry. I do not want to emulate you in terms of giving away free things. I just, I just can't do that to myself. Make them work for it. I got I seriously should. I need to practice. Like, I really do. I really yeah, no, man. Like you got to, yeah, get some exercise on your hands, and you know, got to get you some, some, some cortisone. 
Or, no, that's not it. That's the fucking answer. Join us on the next episode of Super Desperation Radio, where we have all 150 viewers join us on Discord and all talk at the same time. Oh, yeah, there we go. Every <laughs> guest from the past will be on the next episode. Every guest we'll... from the past. Every every chatter from the past. Every chatter from the present. All with different Anybody, topics to talk about. come on in. <laughs> we'll have a potluck. Oh, my God. You got to bring your own shit. All right. Uh, Paul's not here, so I guess I got to do this. Um... You ain't got to do shit. I don't have to do shit. I'm just going to go do what I do best, man. Hey! <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. We should end it with that. Super Desperation Radio!